Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A teacher is speaking to a group of students. B. People are dining at a restaurant. C. A woman is riding on a board in a train station. D. Passengers are walking through security at an airport. The correct answer is C. A woman is riding on a board in a train station. Number 2. A. A teacher is giving a presentation to students in a classroom. B. A woman is explaining a project at a conference. C. A group of people is attending a meeting in an office. D. Workers are preparing for a business meeting in a boardroom. The correct answer is A. A teacher is giving a presentation to students in a classroom. Number 3. A. A woman is reading a book at a restaurant. B. A waiter is serving drinks to a group of people. C. People are waiting in line to order food. D. A waiter is assisting a customer with her laptop. The correct answer is D. A waiter is assisting a customer with her laptop. Number 4. A. A train is leaving the platform while people are waiting. B. A group of tourists is waiting in line for a tour. C. Passengers are boarding a train at a station. D. Two workers are preparing drinks at a train station. The correct answer is D. Two workers are preparing drinks at a train station. Number 5. A. Two people are sitting at a table in a cafe. B. A cashier is scanning items at a checkout counter. C. A man is pointing while holding a tray of drinks. D. Customers are standing in line at a ticket counter. The correct answer is C. A man is pointing while holding a tray of drinks. Number 6. A. A group of engineers is discussing a project. B. Two people are reviewing blueprints in an office. C. An architect is giving a presentation to a client. D. Two people are having a meeting in a conference room. The correct answer is B. Two people are reviewing blueprints in an office. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Did you finish the report from Mr. Thompson? A. I will complete it by tomorrow. B. The presentation is at 3 p.m. C. No, I didn't go skiing. The correct answer is A. I will complete it by tomorrow. Number 2. Which software are we using? A. The new CRM system. B. I need to install it. C. We were just informed. The correct answer is A. The new CRM system. Number 3. Who's presenting the project? A. Next Tuesday. B. David is. C. It's about marketing. The correct answer is B. David is. Number 4. Who is presenting at the meeting? A. In conference room A. B. About 30 minutes. C. Mr. Lee from marketing. The correct answer is C. Mr. Lee from marketing. Number 5. Why were you late to the office today? A. There was heavy traffic. B. I finished my work early. C. I have a meeting at noon.
The correct answer is A. There was heavy traffic. Number 6. What's your opinion on the new policy? A. I think it's very effective. B. I prefer chocolate. C. No, I didn't watch the news. The correct answer is A. I think it's very effective. Number 7. Why is the shipment delayed? A. I will get back to you on that. B. There was a problem at customs. C. Let's wait for an update. The correct answer is B. There was a problem at customs. Number 8. Who will lead the project? A. I attended a workshop. B. Mr. Smith will. C. The files are on your desk. The correct answer is B. Mr. Smith will. Number 9. How often does the bus run? A. Every 30 minutes. B. I work from home. C. I came by car. The correct answer is A. Every 30 minutes. Number 10. Who will be leading the meeting today? A. Yes, I do. B. I already ate. C. Mr. Smith will. The correct answer is C. Mr. Smith will. Number 11. Is it going to rain tomorrow? A. The forecast says it will. B. I'm not sure. C. Yes, I do. The correct answer is A. The forecast says it will. Number 12. How often do you travel for business? A. To New York. B. Twice a month. C. I need new luggage. The correct answer is B. Twice a month. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening. Conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. I'm thinking about organizing a team building event next month. That sounds great. Do you have any ideas in mind? Yes. I thought we could have an outdoor activity like a picnic or a hiking trip. A picnic sounds like a wonderful idea. I'll start planning the details then. What kind of event are they discussing? A. A training session. B. A team building event. C. A business seminar. The correct answer is B. A team building event. Number 2. Are you joining us for the team lunch today? I have a conference call at noon, but I might join afterwards. We're meeting at the new cafe down the street. Text me the location and I'll come if I can. Where is the team lunch taking place? A. At the new cafe. B. At the office canteen. C. In a restaurant. The correct answer is A. At the new cafe. Number 3. The printer in the main office is out of order. Oh no, that's not good. I called the service team and they said they'll come by this afternoon. Thanks for handling that. When will the service team come? A. Tomorrow. B. This afternoon. C. This morning. The correct answer is B. This afternoon. Number 4. Have you confirmed the flight details for our business trip? Not yet. I'm waiting for the travel agency to get back to me. Can you make sure to do it by the end of today? Absolutely. I'll follow up with them now. When will the flight details be confirmed? A. This morning. B. By the end of today. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is B. By the end of today. Number 5. Could you help me with the presentation for the client meeting? Of course. When is the meeting? It's scheduled for Wednesday at 10 a.m. 
Perfect. Let's meet tomorrow at 3 p.m. to go over it. When is the client meeting? A. Tuesday at 10 a.m. B. Wednesday at 10 a.m. C. Thursday at 10 a.m. The correct answer is B. Wednesday at 10 a.m. Number 6. Can we reschedule our lunch appointment? Sure, how about Friday instead of Thursday? Friday works for me. Great, see you then. When is the new lunch appointment? A. Friday. B. Thursday. C. Wednesday. The correct answer is A. Friday. Number 7. Have you seen the new intern's report? Yes, I reviewed it yesterday. What did you think? It's quite thorough. She did a great job. When did the man review the intern's report? A. Today. B. Yesterday. C. Last week. The correct answer is B. Yesterday. Number 8. I need to send this package to New York. Can you take it to the post office? Sure. When does it need to arrive? It should get there by Friday. I'll send it with express shipping then. When does the package need to arrive? A. Tomorrow. B. By Friday. C. By next week. The correct answer is B. By Friday. Number 9. Did you finish the report for the marketing meeting? Yes, I emailed it to you this morning. Great. Did you also include the latest sales data? Yes, it's all in there in the appendix. What did the man do this morning? A. Called a client. B. Scheduled a meeting. C. Emailed a report. The correct answer is C. Emailed a report. Number 10. I need to reschedule our meeting from Friday to Thursday. I have a conflict on Thursday morning, but I'm free in the afternoon. Can we do 2 p.m.? That works for me. When will the rescheduled meeting take place? A. Thursday afternoon at 2 p.m. B. Thursday morning. C. Friday morning. The correct answer is A. Thursday afternoon at 2 p.m. Number 11. Have you finished designing the new brochure? Yes, I just sent it to your email for review. Excellent. I'll take a look and get back to you by tomorrow. Perfect. Thank you. When will the man review the brochure? A. Next week. B. Today. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is C. Tomorrow. Number 12. I think we should update our website. I agree. It's been a few years since the last redesign. Should we hire a professional or do it in-house? Let's look at some professional services first. What will they do first? A. Design it themselves. B. Look at professional services. C. Hire an intern. The correct answer is B. Look at professional services. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Please pay attention to this safety announcement. Always wear your seatbelt while driving. In case of an emergency, follow the exit signs and leave the building calmly. Your safety is our priority. What should you do in case of an emergency? A. Call for help immediately. B. Follow the exit signs and leave the building calmly. C. Stay seated and wait for instructions. The correct answer is C. Follow the exit signs and leave the building calmly. Number 2. Welcome to our annual charity auction. We're excited to present a variety of unique items all proceeds of which will go towards supporting local animal shelters. The event will start at 6 p.m. and refreshments will be served. What time does the event start? A. 6 p.m. B. 
5 p.m. C. 7 p.m. The correct answer is C. 6 p.m. Number 3. This is a gentle reminder that our company meeting will take place tomorrow in the main conference room. The meeting will start promptly at 9 o'clock a.m. and will cover quarterly performance and upcoming projects. Attendance is mandatory. What will be discussed in the company meeting? A. New hires. B. Quarterly performance and upcoming projects. C. Holiday plans. The correct answer is B. Quarterly performance and upcoming projects. Number 4. Hello, and welcome to our cooking seminar. Today, the chef will demonstrate how to prepare a three-course meal using seasonal ingredients. Make sure to take notes and ask questions after the demonstration. We hope you enjoy and get inspired to cook more at home. What will the chef demonstrate today? A. How to bake a cake. B. How to make a quick snack. C. How to prepare a three-course meal using seasonal ingredients. The correct answer is B. How to prepare a three-course meal using seasonal ingredients. Number 5. Attention shoppers, our store will be closing in 30 minutes. Please bring all purchases to the checkout counters. Remember to take advantage of our special evening discounts available until closing time. Thank you for shopping with us. How long until the store closes? A. 15 minutes. B. 30 minutes. C. 1 hour. The correct answer is C. 30 minutes. Number 6. This is a public service announcement regarding water conservation. Please fix any leaking taps and reduce shower time. By conserving water, we help ensure enough supply for everyone in the community. What should people do to conserve water? A. Leave taps running. B. Take longer showers. C. Fix leaking taps and reduce shower time. The correct answer is C. Fix leaking taps and reduce shower time. Number 7. Hi, pet owners. Are you looking for high-quality pet food? Look no further than Paws and Claws Pet Store. For this month only, we are offering a buy one, get one free deal on all dog and cat food. Visit us today to take advantage of this amazing offer and make your pets happy and healthy. What special offer is available at the pet store? A. Buy one get one free on pet food. B. Discount on accessories. C. Free grooming session. The correct answer is B. Buy one get one free on pet food. Number 8. Attention commuters. The Green Line Metro will be closed for maintenance this weekend. Shuttle buses will operate between affected stations. Regular service will resume on Monday. Thank you for your patience. When will regular service resume? A. This Saturday. B. Next Friday. C. On Monday. The correct answer is C. On Monday. Number 9. Our company's annual picnic is this Sunday at Riverside Park. Employees and their families are invited to attend. We have planned games, a barbecue, and a raffle. Please RSVP by Friday to ensure we have enough food and drinks for everyone. What should employees do by Friday? A. RSVP to attend. B. Invite their families. C. Attend games and raffle. The correct answer is A. RSVP to attend. Number 10. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining our webinar. Today, we'll discuss effective team collaboration. Key points include communication tools and project management techniques. Stay tuned for a live demo. What is one of the key points discussed? A. Communication tools. B. Marketing strategies. C. Online sales.
The correct answer is C. Communication tools. Number 11. We are excited to announce the launch of our new mobile app. You can now shop, track orders, and get exclusive deals right from your phone. Download the app today and enjoy a 10% discount on your first purchase. What discount is offered for downloading the app? A. 10% on the first purchase. B. Free shipping. C. 20% on all items. The correct answer is B. 10% on the first purchase. Number 12. Welcome to the annual charity marathon. Make sure to stay hydrated and follow the designated paths marked by the volunteers. The event will conclude near the city park at 3 p.m. Thank you for your participation and support. Where will the event conclude? A. At the starting point. B. Near the city park. C. At the town hall. The correct answer is C. Near the city park. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one. The results will. Tomorrow. A. Announce. B. Announced. C. Be announced. D. Announcing. The correct answer is. C. Be announced. Number two. John can play the piano. His younger brother. A. Good as. B. Better than. C. As good as. D. Well as. The correct answer is. B. Better than. Number three. If he. The deadline, he will get a bonus. A. Meet. B. Meeting. C. Met. D. Meets. The correct answer is D. Meets. Number four. The project is difficult than we expected. A. Most. B. Two. C. More. D. As. The correct answer is C. More. Number 5. The weather was bad. They still held the event. A. Since. B. Despite. C. Because. D. Although. The correct answer is. D. Although. Number 6. We finished the task. Time for the presentation. A. On. B. At. C. By. D. In. The correct answer is D. In. Number 7. She. The meeting when the phone rang. A. Attended. B. Is attending. C. Will attend. D. Was attending. The correct answer is D. Was attending. Number 8. They have been working. The project for three months. A. At. B. In. C. With. D. On. The correct answer is. D. On. Number nine. I'll meet you. The front of the building. A. On. B. At. C. By. D. In. The correct answer is B. At. Number 10. The presentation was interesting than I expected. A. Very. B. Most. C. More. D. So. The 
The correct answer is C. More. Number 11. The results. Already sent to the client. A. Was. B. Will be. C. Are being. D. Have been. The correct answer is D. Have been. Number 12. Would you mind? Me a hand with this task? A. Giving. B. Give. C. To give. D. Gave. The correct answer is A. Giving. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. To all employees, the company picnic has been scheduled for next Saturday. Please. Your attendance by Friday. Thank you, management. A. Confirmed. B. Confirms. C. Confirm. D. Confirmation. The correct answer is C. Confirm. Number 2. To all staff, there will be a mandatory meeting on Wednesday at 3 p.m. Please ensure you on time and have read the agenda beforehand. A. Arrival. B. Arrives. C. Arriving. D. Arrive. The correct answer is D. Arrive. Number 3. Mr. Lee has requested that all employees to the guidelines outlined in the new company policy, your cooperation is appreciated. A. Adhered. B. Adheres. C. Adhering. D. Adhere. The correct answer is D. Adhere. Number 4. Our sales figures for this quarter have significantly compared to the last quarter. Let's continue our hard work. A. Increasing. B. Increases. C. Increase. D. Increased. The correct answer is D. Increased. Number 5. Memo. All employees are requested to attend the training session scheduled. Monday. Thank you, admin team. A. To. B. In. C. On. D. Four. The correct answer is C. On. Number six. Announcement. The annual company picnic will take place. The 15th of next month. All employees and their families are welcome. Best. Organizing committee. A. To. B. At. C. In. D. On. The correct answer is D. On. And finally, part 7. Reading. Reading comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Thank you for subscribing to our monthly newsletter. This issue includes top tips for improving workplace productivity, an interview with our CEO, and highlights from our recent product launch event. Be sure to stay tuned for next month's edition for more valuable insights. What topics are included in this newsletter edition? A. Productivity tips and CEO interview. B. Holiday announcements. C. Job openings. The correct answer is A. Productivity tips and CEO interview. Number 2. Team members. We are hosting a webinar on Effective Remote Work Strategies next Friday at 3 p.m. Please mark your calendars and attend the session to enhance your productivity while working from home. An email with the webinar link will be sent shortly. Regards, HR Department. What is the purpose of this email? A. To announce a new work policy. B. To inform about an upcoming webinar. C. To schedule performance reviews. The correct answer is B. 
to inform about an upcoming webinar. Number three, dear residents, annual maintenance work on the community pool will commence next Monday and is anticipated to last one week. Please plan accordingly and avoid the pool area during this period. Thank you for your cooperation. What is being announced? A. Maintenance work on the community pool. B. Introduction of new safety rules. C. An upcoming community event. The correct answer is A. A change in pool operating hours. Number 4. Dear Partners, Our annual conference will be held virtually this year due to ongoing health concerns. Please register online to participate. We appreciate your understanding. Sincerely, the Organizing Committee. What is the main change to the conference? A. It will be held virtually. B. It will have new speakers. C. It will be postponed. The correct answer is A. It will be held virtually. Number 5. Our annual charity run will take place on Sunday, May 22nd at Riverside Park. This year, we are raising funds to support local education initiatives. Registration starts at 7 a.m. and the run begins at 8 a.m. We hope to see many participants. Regards, Event Committee. What is the purpose of this event? A. To promote a new product. B. To celebrate a holiday. C. To support local education initiatives. The correct answer is C. To support healthcare causes. Number 6. To all employees, starting next month, the company will implement a new flexible working hours policy. This change aims to provide better work-life balance and improve productivity. More details will be shared in the upcoming staff meeting. What is the reason for implementing the new policy? A. To extend working hours. B. To reduce employee wages. C. To provide better work-life balance. The correct answer is C to increase office space. Number 7. To all staff, please note that the annual company picnic will be held on July 12th at Greenfield Park. Families are welcome, and there will be games, food, and fun activities for all. Please RSVP by June 15th. Sincerely, HR Department. What is the purpose of the email? A. To announce a company picnic. B. To provide work policy updates. C to introduce a new employee. The correct answer is A, to announce a company picnic. Number eight, due to essential maintenance work, the office internet service will be unavailable from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. on Friday, August 30th. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and appreciate your understanding while we work to improve the service. When will the office internet be unavailable? A. All day on Saturday. B. From 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. on Friday, August 30th. C. During office hours on Monday. The correct answer is B. From 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. on Friday, August 30th. Number 9. Dear students, Please be advised that the library will be closed for inventory checks from Monday to Wednesday next week. Make sure to check out any study materials you may need before then. We apologize for any inconvenience. Regards, library staff. Why will the library be closed? A. For inventory checks. B. For staff training. C. For renovations. The correct answer is A. For inventory checks. Number 10. Attention residents. The water supply will be interrupted on Saturday, August 12th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. due to maintenance work. Please store enough water for your needs during this period. We apologize for any inconvenience. Best regards, maintenance team. Why will the water supply be interrupted? A. Due to a holiday event. B. Due to an inspection. C. Due to maintenance work.
The correct answer is C. Due to maintenance work. Number 11. Attention online shoppers. Starting next week, online purchases will qualify for free shipping on orders over $50. This new policy aims to provide greater convenience and savings to our customers. Thank you for your continued support. What is the new benefit mentioned? A. Free shipping on orders over $50. B. Expedited shipping for all orders. C. Discount on first purchase. The correct answer is A. Free shipping on orders over $50. Number 12. Due to scheduled software upgrades, the company network will be offline on Saturday, February 10th, from 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. Please ensure that all necessary work is saved and completed before the downtime. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. When will the network be offline? A. February 10th, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. B. February 11th, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. C. February 10th, 10 p.m., 2 a.m. The correct answer is C. February 10th, 10 p.m., 2 a.m. Number 13. Dear customers, we are excited to announce a, that our new product line will be launched next month. This innovative range is designed to meet your needs better than ever before. Pre-orders start this Saturday. Stay tuned for more updates. Thank you for your continued support. Best, marketing team. When do pre-orders start? A, this Saturday. B, next Monday. C, next Friday. The correct answer is A, this Saturday. Number 14, attention employees. Our annual holiday party, will be held on December 20th at the Grand Ballroom. Please RSVP by December 10th to ensure we have an accurate headcount for catering purposes. We hope to see you all there. What is the main subject of this announcement? A. Launch of a new project. B. Change in office hours. C. Details of the holiday party. The correct answer is C. Details of the holiday party. Number 15. Attention shoppers. We are holding our annual clearance sale starting next Monday. Expect significant discounts on all items storewide. Don't miss out on these amazing deals. When does the clearance sale begin? A. This Monday. B. Next Monday. C. This Friday. The correct answer is B. Next Monday. Number 16. We are currently offering a special promotion on our premium membership plan. Sign up before the end of the month to receive a 50% discount on your first year's membership fee. Enjoy exclusive benefits and access to premium content by upgrading now. What is the promotion about? A. Discount on premium membership. B. Monthly sign up. C. Exclusive benefits. The correct answer is A. Discount on premium membership. Number 17. We are pleased to inform you that your credit card application has been approved. Your new card will be delivered within 5 to 7 business days. Should you have any questions, do not hesitate to contact our customer service. Thank you for choosing our bank. Sincerely, Credit Services Team. What is the main purpose of this message? A. To announce a delivery delay. B. To request additional information. C. To approve a credit card application. The correct answer is C. To approve a credit card application. Number 18. Attention all team members. Please submit your completed project reports by the end of the day on Thursday, April 15th. Late submissions will not be accepted unless prior approval is granted. Thank you. Project Management When is the deadline for the project reports? A. Friday, April 16th. B. Thursday, April 15th. 
C. Wednesday, April 14. The correct answer is B. Thursday, April 15th.